Hi, welcome back to another uh, video tip here at A Bar Above. Today we're going to be talking about tools. And I'm not talking about some of the customers that might come into our bars. I'm actually talking about the tools we use on a daily basis to make our drinks and craft our cocktails and make people happy. So today we're going to focus on strainers and uh, the three types that we typically use behind a bar and how to use them correctly. The three types of strainers that we have here is um, the julep strainer. This one is the Hawthorne strainer, which uh, is characterized by having a spring that you can compress. And we also have the fine strainer here, which we'll use on our shaking cocktails. Great, now, so now let's take a look and see how they all fit together and um, how to use these tools properly. So let's start off with our julep strainer. Um, the julep strainer is actually designed to fit in these three um, glasses. So if you use a mixing glass behind your bar, meant to go right across the top, straighten out any of the solids, the ice pieces and stuff like that. Also, if you're using a cheater tin, it goes right inside and you can pour very nicely out of it. And uh, if you're accustomed to using glass, um, it fits very nicely over the top of it. And once again, separates all your um, big pieces. Now for the, um, the Hawthorne strainer, this is designed to go over the large part of your Boston shaker and also has this uh, metal piece so that you can control the, the tightness of the, um, the, um, the strainer. Um, but it, since it does have all these springs in it that can press, it will fit, fit very snugly, snugly over all of the other uh, mixing glasses and cheater tins and everything else. So, um, which is kind of handy if you, this is all you have and uh, you need to separate some of the finer stuff. It kind of compresses the coils down and enables you to do that. Now with the fine strainer, um, this is meant specifically for any kind of shaken cocktails that you use. Um, so it's going to be in combination with either the, the julep strainer or the Hawthorne strainer. And you're basically just going to be using it to Strain out any ice fragments that uh, will get into your cocktail, any um, juice pulp if you're using fresh squeezed juices. Um, so yeah, definitely be in the habit of using this. And just as a demonstration, it, it should fit nicely over any of the glasses you're using. And you would just pour it straight over like that. So there you have it, the three different strainers and how we utilize them um, behind mixology bars. So thank you very much. I hope you guys have a great shift and cheers.